The fertile land of the Palouse farming region in the northwestern United States is a natural wonder. The lush meadows are reminiscent of an undulating sea or the splashes of pastel colors of a talented artist. In the palette of the artist nature this time there were green hills and dunes, as well as rich dark color of fertile soil. Palouse is a photographer's paradise, yet the area remains largely unknown until now. Palouse farmland covers southeastern Washington, north-central Idaho, and even extends south and northeastern Oregon. Palouse is located just south of the city of Spokane, farms about 3,000 square miles, and grows wheat and legumes. Palouse's picturesque sill dunes were formed thousands of years ago during the Ice Age. Numerous hills have formed on what is now Palouse, which is a chaotic alternation of highs and lows. The steepest trails may be located at a slope of 50% in relation to the slope, and the minimum range of elevations is from 5 cm to 130 cm in depth. Unlike other prairies in North America, the Palouse is a naturally formed part of the ecosystem. No land has been burned or cattle grazed on moss here. The Palouse was originally a vast expanse of grassland, but with the arrival of European settlers in the 19th century, intensive agriculture began to flourish in the area. The consumerist attitude of agrarians led to the fact that today there are almost no native plants on the Palouse, most of the prairie today is devoted to farm fields, and small towns have sprung up here as well. Unfortunately, human activities have once again threatened the existence of Palouse's picturesque prairies. All that still reminds one of its former boundless beauty are the unique plants, which orphan themselves along paved roads and railroad tracks, on the edges of plowed fields and developed pastures, along surviving streams, and in open areas of pine forests that were miraculously not cut down.